Go on, buddies. Nope. Oh, well, that's all of them down. That was a fast fight. <laughs> uh, well, not really early. I stream at uh, noon my time tomorrow. So, it gives me 12 hours between when the stream ends and when my next stream starts. So, I'm, I'm pretty set up. And go buy something. What do you mean, think? Sweetheart, don't think. Just put something on and shine. I like this girl. Alright, what do we got? Um, before I start selling crap, let me very quickly go through my inventory and pick some new stuff to equip. Let's take up all these mods that I don't need. Put a new... I'll take my shotgun on this thing. Get a scope for it. New new pistol? No new pistol. New sniper rifle. Ah, uh, probably should get a new sniper rifle. This thing's DPS is really low, but that's a. It's pretty bonkers strong, so I'm gonna keep it. Got a new bandana. Blooming amber bandana. I don't have any new face set. I've got new some new bulletproof vests. Ooh, crit damage by thirty percent. That's pretty good. I lose a little bit of, um, here, I'm gonna replace this with a armor up mod. There we go. This is a pretty strong combat vest I've got on. Tank top? Nope, no need to replace my tank top. My shoes are good. Don't really need my suits. Um, could always equip a, an actual melee weapon, but, <laughs> like, I don't really need it. So I'm going to disassemble pretty much anything that's not white. I think that's the plan. Just to get some more uh, parts for, you know, building. Okay, I don't want to accidentally disassemble that, though. So that's uh, a one-time use weapon. Here we go. Uh... Probably good enough. What do you got for me? Let's sell you. I've got a, quite a bit of cash right now, so I'm not super worried about making money as I am about um, uh, getting good stuff to equip. Ooh, those are new pants. Oh, I can't wear them yet. Okay. That's why I couldn't equip them, because I'm not on the level. I think. Wait, what level are they? Oh no, I can't totally wear these. Yep. Alright. Let's sell those old pants. And see what see see what you got for sale. Um I could use a new undershirt that's got a mod slot. That's the thing I could take. Ooh, two twenty-six. That's better than either of those. I can use shoes that have got a mod slot. Gold Fury Neotac Bulletproof Pants. Uh, immunity to Burn. That's not too bad. Some new shoes. Um, two levels in. No, I won't bother. But I will. Yeah, I'll, I'll buy that. And I'll buy... I don't really need either of those. Okay, let's equip those really quick. And I can slap, I don't know, uh, green armor mod into them. And I can slap a green armor mod into that one. There we go. Should have quite a bit of armor. I can sell all my clothes that I don't need. There we go. Okay. So. This is probably a pretty silly idea, but I'm gonna go try to do this quest that I'm gonna decide. Cause this is a um, very hard quest, meaning the enemies here are gonna be a much higher level than I am. You know, despite me being pretty far into the game by now. But we're gonna we're gonna see how this goes. So what is what's this mission about? I gotta talk. I gotta look at my message from Pablo, or Padre. Details. Retrieve a Militech car purchased by the Nomads. They uh, decided to run some side business in Night City and bought a stolen SUV. 
Uh, I was having my turf, but they forgot to ask me for help because they didn't want to cut a fixer. Valentinos took the Eddie, slammed their heads against the pavement, and told them to fuck off. Yep, so, of course, I'm getting that car. This character is a nomad, so I, I, I'll, I'll rep that. So this character has no hacking capability whatsoever, meaning I'm kind of just on my own when it comes to a lot of this, these stealth sections. Normally you could do things like hack the camera systems and disable them to look at where the guys are, right? but I'm kind of just stuck with my own personal stealth abilities, which I'll let you know aren't very good. So I'm probably just going to have to bust in the front door. Okay. As you can see, these guys are very high level. And I'm not really doing the most amount of damage to them. And I'm dead in one shot. Alright, let's try this again. And I'm dead again. Alright. I think I'm too low level for those guys. Last checkpoint and probably just peace for a bit because um, I'm definitely not at a high enough level for that quest. Okay, let's pick it up. Quest. Um, let's go. Danger very high. Danger regular high. Yeah, let's, let's bust over this way and we can stop a crime in progress while we're heading that way. Um, uh, one thing I was thinking about is... Um, I know people enjoy the Ara Ara, as we've seen. Um, are there any other voice lines I should add as, like, default, um, points requests? Also, I updated my little points icon. I hope you all like it. I'm actually using one of the coins taken from my, uh... If you look down, my about section has like a my me holding coin and just throwing it in the air. So I just grabbed one of those and made that into my little points icon. Do I have a catchphrase? Um, no, I really don't. You see, the, the problem with a catchphrase is you need to be a funny original person to come up with things like that, and I'm not funny or original. <laughs> Hold up. What? Oh, these are bad guys. Okay. There we go. Alright. Hey, hey, people. I, I don't want to do that because, like, I respect Seth as a streamer. I don't want to just kind of take his bit. That's pretty awful, to be honest. I'm not a fan of that, but I, hey, I, I guess I stopped the bad guys. There's a lot of quests in this game that are just kind of sad, because you beat up the people who do the crime, but the crime doesn't really get undone. Those people they beat up are still beat up, or the people they killed are still killed. You kind of just look at the aftermath. I was thinking of uh, swapping out my... Um, What does Fred say? You know what? I'm gonna admit I don't know what that means. Key, I'm uh, not hip. It, I'm not hip with the kids. I really don't understand a lot of pop culture references. Scooby-Doo, yeah, yeah. I know Scooby-Doo. Wait, wait, does Fred say something in Scooby- Is he got a catchphrase in Scooby-Doo? Or is that what you were asking? Oh. Uh. 
I like traps. Like that? So he likes traps. He reads trap magazines. I read the trap magazine for the articles, I swear. Uh, May May? Yes, I've heard of those mysterious things called May Mays before. There's no door in there. Well, oh, maybe that—that's the door. No. You got something to say? Oh, is there not a window here? Hold on. Ah, oh no, there is. How did they get in that room? One of one of Cyberpunk's many mysteries. Oh, hey, okay. one of. Whatever. I like these giant red pillars of light that are probably supposed to be, like, I don't know, like an ad sign or something like that. But something's clearly gone wrong and they just ain't. Yeah, like a little, like, pseudo park thing. Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Alright, my apologies. I'm sorry. Where's, where's this gunfire coming from? Down here. I'll get down there. I gotta help. Beat up the bad guys. Boink. Boink. There we go. Oh, there's still a guy alive. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, I don't want to yell too loud right now, as I do live in a house with other people. So I don't really have the freedom to just scream as loud as I want. But uh, maybe in the future, I will have a um, expletive point reward. Or just scream and swear words as loud as possible. Alright, just trying to get hit by... Oh, I got hit by... Oh, wait. Got a guy I need gone. What this happened? Used to be iron for hire. Still acts like it. But the eddies are worth the risk, trust me. Need more intel, check the attachment. Waiting on your seat. Thanks. Okay. I kinda like these quests when you gotta go in somewhere. Um I don't know. What am I doing? Jack Mossers. Night City's gonkest merc. Did a recent job for me and went too far. Way too fucking far. He was supposed to clap some shards for a Zeta Tech transport, quiet like. Except it wasn't fucking quiet. <laughs> that psycho offed every single guard, beheaded the driver, and blew up the truck. Hold on a minute. That me? <laughs> Shrink or expand my model? That's pretty good, actually. Alright. Whoa! Think fleas like you just get in for free? Yeah, I fucking do. You got VIP rooms here? You know, for private shindigs? Reserved for the boss and co. Think he could use a little more company? Hmm? Don't try to play me. Either I see Eddie's, or your ass is walking. Alright. Option one. If I do this mission and then he takes away my money because I didn't do it quietly enough, Come on, I have to reload. But, for now... Oh, let's do it in. For now, though, I can just bust my way in. Oh. It's a terrorist attack! It's a terrorist attack? No, it's not. Not a terrorist. Sweet Jesus. You hear that? Do you hear what they're playing? Yeah, Johnny, I hear it. That's what peeps with bad taste always say. Don't know what he did to deserve what's coming, but his music taste is reason enough to try. Alright. Uh. 
you couldn't tell, I'm critting a whole lot. Yeah, I could pay this guy's money, or I could just beat everyone up. Uh, as you see, I'm a dragon, and I must jealously guard my horde. Um, the Odyssey. Say what thy birth and what name you bore, imposed by parents in the natural hour. Far from the natal hour, distinctive names, one common right, and great and lowly claims. Say from what city, from what regions tossed, and what inhabitants those regions bossed. And, thou sh and shalt thou instant reach the realm assigned, and wondrous ships, self-moved, instinct with mind. No helm secures their course, no pilot guides. Like man intelligent, they plow the tides, conscious of every coast and every bay that lies beneath the sun's all-seeing ray. Through clouds and darkness veil the encumbered sky, fearless through the darkness and through the clouds they fly. Through tempests rage, through rolls the swelling main, the seas may roll, the tempests rage in vain. Even the stern god that over the wave presides, safe as they pass, and safer pass the tides, with fury burns, while careless they convey, promiscuous every guest to every bay. These ears have heard my royal sire to close, a dreadful story, big with future woes, how Neptune raged, and how by his command, firm rooted in a surge, a ship should stand, a monument of wrath, how mound on mound should bury these proud towers beneath the ground. But this the gods may frustrate or fulfill, as suits the purpose of the eternal will. But say, though, what waste regions hast thou stayed, what customs noted and what coasts surveyed, possessed by wild barbarians fierce in arms, or men whose bosoms tender pity warms. Say what the fate of Troy awakened thy cares, why heaved thy bosom, why flowed thy tears. Homer. <laughs> I just started doing that, but I was not expecting to just find Homer's Odyssey in this dude's club. Just on a counter. Oh, that guy got me good. That's the danger of these high-level goons. A couple shots takes me down. Okay. Um, you good in here, dude? Alright, let's chill for a minute. Oh boy! Hey! Let's let's talk! <laughs> Alright, where am I going? Will you promise to quit pissing in my fucking ear? Where are these guys? Oh, down, down. Yo! That's a legendary baton just sitting in the open. I dig it. Need some cash. Hold up, did I, did, I, did I drop the dude who I was supposed to fight? I think I might have dropped the guy I was supposed to gonk while I was here. Um... I might have just done that by accident, though. One of these bodies upstairs is the guy I was looking for. Uh, what's that? Okay, just let me get past you. I'm gonna bust this camera. Is one of these guys? Was it this guy over here? No, he's just a bouncer. Did I already get the guy I was here for? This is the stealth route if you wanted to get to the club without uh, doing what I did. Um, but as you can see, as a dragon, I'm pretty just strong enough to take what I want for most cases. Which is uh, pretty useful. Can use this guy? Yeah, it's this guy. This is him. <laughs> Need some gear in case it gets a gonk idea. He does have a gun on him. It's just, uh... Yeah, it's underneath his body. I don't want to really pick him up and move him. I guess we'll just... I don't I guess. Alright, cool. Uh... 
Hello. stairs. Hey, you! <laughs> Sorry, civilian. I didn't mean to get in your way. Um, around the corner. And up the stairs. Up some stairs. Getting gutted! Heard whispers Mosser bit the concrete. Nicely done. Gig sealed. Your boy Dino needs a drink. <laughs> Alright. There we go. And you see sometimes people just cower after you after they see you commit violence. But uh most of the time they're pretty cool with it. Alright, let's uh take a look at my map. Who's near me? Um vehicle. Side job. But on my way I'll stop by another clothing shop and see if uh they got any new threads. Also I can unload some of my loot that I don't need. They say that you're a deserter. If I gotta be associated with you, I need to hear it straight. Cause I'm stars and stripes for life. Yeah. Feel me? Yeah, went AWOL, it's true. What they won't tell you is that I did it out of patriotism. I don't think that's how it fucking works, okay. son. Okay, look. So when all the conversation to some anti-corpo protest. Next thing you know, they order me with lead to yeah. his eyes. And then Yeah, he's just pissing. Personally, he's pissing a lot. His family, their son died a hero fighting against the enemy. Hey, at least he go down a hero, right? While the formal complaint telling him what I thought. So they demoted me, took all my implants. Yeah, I know, right? Only then did I dealt the fuck out of there. Huh. Well, but yeah, okay, so quick save here. And, uh. Get her away from me! Fuck this shit! <laughs> I'm not allowed to punch the kids. And the cops are really strong around here. <laughs> As you can tell. <laughs> so, um, the cops in this game... Uh, this game's AI doesn't quite have an ability to have people drive up to you or walk across the road even. So it just spawns cops in behind you. Um, and those guys that were moving really quick have, like, they, they do this implant dash thing, like what I'm doing now. I will say, that new suit is calling to me. It's eccentric, sure, but in a subtle way. Snakeskin and silver? A lovely combination. Timeless. It would certainly suit. Mm. Always wondered what it... And you come to the... Now, the one th other thing that I'm not a fan of this game is shops don't have unique um, inventories. So, like, I walked into the swankiest most high baller club in a night city like this place is hundreds of thousand dollars on clothes um and then he goes and sells like a reinforced spotted bra or a worn graffiti helmet uh yeah I'll buy that uh Crit damage by 30%. 30% crit chan damage and crit damage. That's nice. Crit chance. Here's some spicy mods. Too bad they cost like a million dollars. Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, the clothing in this game is pretty good. Um, I'm looking for things that have these little circles in them. That means they have a mod slot. And you can mod them to be stronger or whatever, right? So... I'm mostly looking for those. I should probably go pick up, um, since I'm leveling crafting with this character, I should probably go pick up the 
crafting for the defense mod so I can start putting the armor mod into whatever clothes I want rather than having to kind of save them and chop for them when I go looking around. Oh, hey. There's just some uh, medicine in a suitcase so I'm lying on the sidewalk. If you ever see that in real life, uh, don't take drugs you find lying on the ground. But in video games, it's okay. Okay, so everyone ran away there because, um... That was, uh, my character's double jump is a cyber implant, so because I double jumped near them, it, the game registered that I used a cyber implant near them, which is the same kind of thing as my arms are, so people freaked out because they thought I attacked them. Yeah, it's not quite... V, hey, some construction workers went on strike after finding their tools in the morning covered in blood. There's sites a parking lot where gangs have been known to pop up. Gang violence is a maybe. Oh, go, but my go up. on a cyber cycle attack. All if right. I'm right, maybe do what you can to incapacitate him. I'll take it from there. This way. There we go. Yo, okay. Hold up. What happened in here? The guy got hurt. What's this guy? How do he how do you go down? Scavenger's a critical condition. Yeah, so he got shot by what a shotgun there? Yeah. Numerous shotgun wounds. Alright. Let's uh let's find this dude. Where's he at? Oh, you see him over there? See him? That's he. That, that's him. I wonder if I can just sneak up and get him. There we go. We got him. <laughs> Alright, lungs of the order of extensive exposure to unknown chemicals, huh? He was painkillers. And he was coughing up painkillers? Also, that's a hell of a shotgun. Let's read this. Need those neuroblockers. A lot of them now. Chill. Okay, here we get there. What's the pain from anyway? They poisoned me. Fucking biotech. Everyone here's got it. The gun lungs are collapsing. Some are dead already. Alright, that's pretty wild. I'm gonna equip that new shotgun right away, because that sounds pretty good. Boom. Increases headshot damage. What if I just slap as many crunch mods in at a time? There we go. 718 deeps. That's pretty good. Budget arms. Yeah. Oh, hey. It's another beast mod. I wonder if I can stack up beast mods. I've got in my cyberware slot. I've already got a beast mod equipped. Oh yeah, I just get oh oh this is gonna be nasty. Hundred percent bonus damage when berserk's active. When berserk's active, I do fifteen percent more damage. I am pretty set up with this right now. I think. Yeah. Yeah, this, this, this could be pretty spooky. Got a new shotgun, I've got a double beast mod. Alright, um... Let's... 
message my boss. And, uh... Where is G. Jones? Messages. Took a gentle approach. Already went through enough being a lab at Biotechnica. Yeah. First the corpus and the scabs. It's going to stop down with spiral. Alright, cool. So there's a, one of the reasons why I actually picked blunt weapons in this game was because of these quests. Uh, they really want you to not kill these guys because they're really not bad people. They're called cyber psychos because they lost their minds due to their cyber implants. So I'm using blunt weapons to try to, you know, not kill them rather than... Like, if I had Mantis Blight something, I'd be ripping these guys in half and decapitating them, which doesn't really help them get better. Because the lady who's been ta texting me and giving me calls is named, uh... You think only you got problems? Okay, so as you can see, I fell on that lady and she died, and then a police started teleporting in behind me, so I'm just gonna run away. Let's just, let's just move out of, out of where those police are. Um... Yeah, we'll head over here. Yeah, the cops don't really have, like... It's not like GTA where they'll follow you, because like I said earlier, they can't. I don't know how to pull my weapon out. <laughs> I think the game might have bugged. It's okay. I got grenades. Sorry, buddy. I didn't really want to kill you with a grenade. I felt like that's a bit rude, but... Oh, you didn't really give me much of an option. I can't draw the weapon still. Uh, have I adopted a cat yet? Yeah, I've got a, I've got a cat. Not in the room with me, but uh, she's just a couple rooms over right now. Welcome back, Key. still can't draw my weapons. Oh, you mean in the game? No, I have not adopted the cat in the game. If there is an option to do that, I have yet to find one. Um, yo, what happened in here? Okay. One of my engineers didn't come to work tonight, or today. I didn't I don't pick up the phone either. Start in the morning, of course. Well, luckily, it's all clear. I'm in the lobby. <laughs> so, in other words, this guy wanted to meet up with somebody, with this lady, uh, and she just came in and shot the hell out of him, I guess. Huh. Well, what kind of storytelling is this? But yes, um, I don't know where the cat adoption is. Um, uh, madness. Also, I don't know how to pull the weapon out. I can't. Oh, that's all tabbing. Like this? I can't do it. I can't draw my weapon. No weapon. Yeah, I... Hmm... 
Okay, well, if I figure out how to find the cat, I definitely will. But until then, I think I'm looking for maybe like a fast travel point? So that I can... Or maybe, maybe, getting, in, maybe getting into a car would fix my issue. Off the bike. Okay, I can't pull my weapon up still. I'm going to save the game and load the game, and we're gonna see if I can uh, pull my weapon out. Because if I just can't draw a weapon for the rest of the game, I think I might have to load back to my old save. There we go. 